Yo what's good guys I'm back with another tutorial and today I'm gonna show you how to make a dream plug type beat for cash dummy for 1600j I don't know how he's pronounced bro booth pack mookie all of them I'm gonna play the full beat for you at the end and I'm gonna give you some important information about a free loop kit that dropped with me and vicious main so definitely stay until the end or just skip to the end I don't care bro but yeah, if you wanna see the tutorial from me and learn how to make a dream plug type beat, then let's then go into the piano roll with me right now. And yeah, let's start with the piano. Okay, so let's start with this minor chord. So yeah, you hear a minor chord. I'm gonna do a quick music theory lesson for you guys. For a minor chord, we will start with our root note and then we will leave two spaces in between and after that three. So, two, three. And if you wanna extend that, then we will do two in between again. So this is our minor seventh chord and we could do a minor ninth or 11th but yeah bro I made the minor 7th and then I took the root note and pitched it down one semitone and yeah we have a minor chord right here right here and then right here we have a diminished chord and the diminished chord is often used in plug and B and jazz and you make a diminished chord by leaving two spaces in between every note so <clears throat> Yeah, that's basically it. I almost use a diminished chord at the end of my bar because it's a, like a really good transition into the next bar. That's it for the piano. And then I did this lead sound. And before we listen to this, I will say that you gotta like follow the melody that you have in your head. So when I did a piano melody, I already built up this like lead sound in my head. It was not a hundred percent like this but kind of like this and then you just have to start clicking in that would fit in this is how i made this lead melody so i don't know really how to explain this but let's listen to this Yeah, so as I said, I had this melody in my head kind of and just added some notes that I think would fit in <clears throat> to make this lead melody very beautiful and yeah, I think it worked really well. And then at the end of the 8 bars, I added this D note to make a little bit of variation. So that's it for the lead melody. Okay, let's go on to the next melody that I made. So this is a mallet from Purity and this is just a little melody that gives some texture and atmosphere so nothing crazy. Then I have this sound. Originally I started like this and then I highlighted everything and used this, I don't know, stretch tool or something to stretch it like this. This is also only for texture and atmosphere so on its own doesn't really do anything but in the mix with the other melodies it goes crazy bro. Let's go on to this sound. Yeah I really like this bell sound from Purity to give this like dreamy feeling. Then I would say let's go over to the drums that I made and I'm gonna show you the whole drum pattern and then I'm gonna explain like the hi-hat and 808. Okay, so let's start with the 808. So I used only the notes that I used for my melody, the root note E and also the A and the G of my piano melody and yeah let's go over to the hi-hat I really like this free step hi-hat I think it gives a lot of bounce and yeah in general just pick some bouncy hi-hats bro and yeah just just something simple but still bouncy 
and then I added a hi-hat roll in front of the clap too but only at this place and this and yeah that's that's it for the hi-hat and 808 snap is just a classic clap pattern for for trap beats so I'm not gonna explain this but then I have some sound effects and then this China perk I really like this you can hear this in I don't know the song name but the new album of D Savage he has a song where he uses this exact pattern I think he has only three perks like this but I really love this so bro this gives so much bounce I think and yeah I really fell in love with this China perk I use this in I don't know five beats of me so far and then I have this perk only at the end of the 8 bars to make like a transition and then the classic Mexico draw snare then let's go over to the mixing I just cut out some frequencies of the melodies that I don't need and put on some reverb where I think it sounded good and I think these are the bell sounds and yeah you can see that I played around with these knobs so if you turn it like this you hear the, the bell 100% on the left side or on the right side and I decided to make it on the left side and then I also turned this knob to the left side and you get the feeling that the piano is like or the melody in general is all over the room and yeah just like this effect in this beat and for the drums I just cut out some frequencies put on uh, this perk to the right side of the ear and for the 808 I pitched up the mid frequencies put on a soft clipper with the basic presets and a sound codizer and also a EQ to boost the low mid and bass frequencies oh shit yeah and I forgot that I added this unique sound at the end of my verse so the last 16 bars I added in this lead sound yeah I think this sounds beautiful bro and I orientated myself with this on the lead melody that I made in the first place and yeah I picked the same notes almost the same rhythm so kinda sounds familiar and yeah that's it for the tutorial I posted a dream plug and plug loop kit a few days ago with my bro Vicious Main. So I'm gonna put a link in the description for that too, that you can check it out. And we have 11 plug loops in there. They are for real going crazy bro. And yeah, you can download the kit for free. So yeah, definitely check that out if you want. I will leave a link to that in the description and also to my other tutorials. I have Evil Plug tutorials, plug and B tutorials and yeah also more plug tutorials I will leave a link for you in the description to that I'm gonna play the full beat right now and have a blessed day bro